The Blues will be back in Sarasota this fall for the 20th annual annual Blues Fest, but there's a chance for music fans to get in the spirit much sooner than that. SNN Local News 6's Adam Shadoff explains. Well, the Sarasota Blues Festival is definitely one of, if not the biggest events here in Sarasota. You can see by all the memorabilia on the wall right here, 20 years worth of a good time, good music, and good fun. Now, the event is going to kick off in November, but we're going to celebrate the tickets going on sale and getting ready for the event this week. Friday, tickets go on sale. Saturday, we're going to have a little kickoff party. It's going to include live music with a big national band, the Lee Boys, a world-renowned uh, blues band, and that's all going to start. Doors open at 7 o'clock, and uh, they're going to go on stage at 8 o'clock. It's going to be a good time. There's going to be food, drinks, and music. And joining me now is Barbara Strauss. Hello there. She, Hi, Barbara. Thanks for being here. Thanks for coming. She's the organizer of the Blues Fest. Just talk about how fun this is. I mean, this is a huge event every year. You you like to say it's the biggest event in Sarasota. It's, it's a good I time, think, isn't it? I think uh, people-wise, we have about 8,000 people there. Uh, this is the 20th year. It'll be November 6th. We've had over 100 bands on the stage. We've had Grammy Award winners, Rock and Roll Hall of Famers, WC Handy Award winners. But we like to party in Sarasota. Yeah. So tickets go on sale for the Blues Fest on Friday, as you said. Mm -hmm. And Saturday, we're going to have a party. We've put up memorabilia from 20 years, all the posters and uh pictures of the award winners and we're going to have a concert with the Lee Boys and Ben Prestige. There's going to be food and wine and uh, party time. Great concert, great walk through memory lane and it's just a party. And this is just kind of a preliminary party to get, get us ready for the big one, right? Something to do in the summer mm -hmm. and we like to tie everything together and it's a reason to celebrate. Ed Smith Stadium has been the host of uh, the Blues Fest for some time now, but everyone knows that that's under construction right now. But you have a plan, and it's just going to be just as, as good as if we're at Ed Smith. Well, it's going to be Plan B. Uh -huh. I'm hoping for Plan A where we've always been. But if not, you have to do what you have to do. We're going to go across the street. Mm -hmm. There is a big grass parking lot there. I'm going to fence it in. There is room for 10,000 people over there. We will have the same thing going on. Great big stage, big national bands do you know who's coming just talk why don't you talk about the bands we have elvin, award winning bands oh award winning bands yeah. we have elvin bishop who's legendary elvin bishop everybody knows fools fooled around and fell in love trombone shorty has been uh, number one on the charts for nine weeks this summer right now as we speak mm -hmm. uh Moreland and Arbuckle are on the Billboard charts as we speak, and Tommy Castro for Blues Lovers won the four top blues music awards in May. So this is a, a big to-do, and everybody's very excited about it. I mean, not only just the great music, but you go outside, you have a few drinks, you have you some eat, food. You drink, you be merry, you dance, you don't worry about anything, and both events, the one on Saturday night, where there are limited tickets, and the one in November 6th, affordable. We do affordable entertainment. Barbara, thank you very much. That's thank you for coming and welcome to absolutely. Sarasota. Absolutely. Thank you. It's nice to be here. That's Barbara Strauss. She heads up the Sarasota Blues Festival. So again, tickets for the Blues Festival in November go on sale on Friday and then we're going to have the kickoff party on Saturday. Doors are open at 7. Bands are going to go on at about 8 o'clock. You might want to get here a little bit early. There are limited tickets for that event. Come take a walk, check out the memorabilia, listen to some great music and have a good time. All right, here is the ticket information for you. Tickets for Saturday's kickoff party are $15 in advance and $20 at the door. They're available at Rocketman Rock and Roll Store, Folks Music Store, and the Sarasota Emporium. You can also visit www.wslr.org for information. And Adam will be joining us a little bit later in sports.